Our team coverage continues with Western Mass News reporter Matt Satilli. He joins us live now in Agawam with the latest on power outages after speaking with officials from MEMA and Westfield Gas and Electric. Matt? Yeah, Paris and Chris, I'm here at the MEMA Control Center. You can see officials behind me, and they're reporting just under 8,000 power outages in the state of Massachusetts and around 1,000 here in Western Mass. Now, Western Mass News spoke with MEMA Regional Manager Bonnie Roy, who says the agency constantly prepares for events like these, making sure emergency plans are in place. For Roy, it requires constant communication with her team to assess the damage and take action. As the storm progresses, again, we'll be continuing with our outreach. Um, seeing where the damage is, asking them to let us know what they need and what damages there are. She says there is an added flooding concern for roads affected by heavy July storms, where repairs are still ongoing. We also spoke to Tom Flaherty Sr., the general manager for Westfield Gas and Electric. He tells Western Mass News less than 100 of the more than 18,000 electric meters are out in Westfield. He identified West Road as the area hit the hardest. And if you see power lines down, stay far away and call for assistance. You see the lines down, you know, just don't go near them. Contact us, contact the fire department, uh, contact the police department. They'll get through to us and we'll send out the crews accordingly. And Western Mass News also receiving a statement from the Massachusetts Department of Transportation reminding residents that travel will be dangerous during this time. And they said stay home if possible and make sure especially to not drive through flooded areas or roads where underpasses may also be flooded. For now, reporting live in Agawam, Matt Satilli, Western Mass News.